morning everyone welcome back happy monday um i don't know whether you noticed last week i cut my fringe i did it on the thursday you know when i was doing my freezer sorting out um but i think it's a little bit i don't know i need to take some more from the back i think because i don't think it's very thick um yeah it goes it literally parts anyway look ends up doing that so yeah but i'm about to go out i need to go and send some parcels um happy monday by the way i don't think i said that it's 20 to 12 um so it's still morning i've had my porridge today i'm going to yeah go and take my parcels and then i'm going to pop to my mum's i've got a collaboration to film later so that won't be part of this video that should be the next one hopefully um so that's with another youtuber as well so stay tuned for that one um yeah there is something i need to show you actually just for a moment so i received this product you're gonna focus so it's called Parsonva Smartwatch. And I've seen a few YouTubers actually receive one of these smartwatches. And it is absolutely lovely. So it looks like that. Now I received this um, quite a while before Christmas. And Matthew wasn't too sure about it. Because, you know, connecting it to your phone and everything. But, you know, I've seen a few people wearing them now. And you know what? They have emailed me. and Because I did say, um, is it okay if I return it to you? Um, rather than do the video. I, f I felt really bad about it. But, you know, I didn't want to keep something if I wasn't going to do the review. But they said, no, you know, keep hold of it. And then, you know, if you do change your mind, you know, you could make a video for us wear it for a bit see what you think so i think i'm going to do that today because i want to get some steps in so let's just take it out of the box i've literally had it out of the box once so it comes with two straps so you've got the leather strap both pink so that's the leather one it's really nice as well it's got gold detail on it um so it is my kind of style and then it's got another strap which is a plastic one which is actually really nice as well so yeah i just think that's really nice but i'm go i'm gonna give it a try because my other smart watch i need to charge up and i just thought this is quite a posh one isn't it I mean, look at that so does this need charging up let's have a look Right, I found it, so it was in the drawer. Matthew hadn't put it back in the box, I'm just filling around with it. Um, so yeah, it's just like a little two-pronged thing that just, and it's a, a USB one, so I've got those plugs in my kitchen. So you just pop it on the bottom like that. So I'm just gonna plug this in and charge it for a bit before I go out. So that come on straight away and started charging. Um, yeah, I'm going to give that a whirl. I think I'm going to stick with the leather strap today. See how I get on with that. Um, but it does come in a really nice box. Cause it's, you know, it, it just reminds me of um, Apple products. There we go, you can see it now. So now, before I go out, I've got to clean my trainers. Look at this. That was from Friday when I was sorting out Izzy's forever bed for her birthday. I was leaning down and digging my toes in the in the mud, so they are a bit muddy. I mean, the bottoms, I ain't going to clean the bottoms because I'm going out walking. So I'm just going to give them a quick scrub. So just, I think I'm just going to clean them with a uh, good old washing up liquid or not. I've been cleaning trainers for years and it's never done on the arm. So. Parcels in the 
in post locker. Actually, I need to check because I've got I've got one that I sold on Vinted. So I've got a Boohoo parcel to send back. And the one through Vinted, I haven't actually checked what sort of postage they've done. Hopefully it's one of those in post lockers. Because there's one right by my mum's and it's just so easy to do. They're great. I mean, I, I use them myself. You know, if I want to send something from myself, not through Vinted, I go on the Impost Locker website and I purchase um, the one that I want because there's small, medium or large lockers. Um, and I just do it that way. And then you reserve a, a locker and then, we well, don't actually reserve the locker, you reserve the payment and then as soon as you've used the locker, they then take payments. They don't even take it straight away, so it's really good. Um, and the most I've paid for a really large, heavy item was four ninety nine. So I think that's pretty good. I think it'd be a lot more through Royal Mail. That's not bad. That is a lot better than they were. That will do. Right, put those down there. Go and grab my parcels. Right, I have completely run out of the tissue paper that I normally put around the item so I'm just gonna have to put it straight in one of these bags which is also screwed up and then I've got my little thank you stickers and this is the lovely item that I've sold it's a little pretty strappy summer dress like three quid that went for. There's my Lenore sheets. My pack of organza bags. These are from my wedding. Found them in the attic. I've got pink ones as well. There's a little blue one. I'm just going to give it a spritz of this crease release. Because it's a bit crease, but that was going to do anything. But freshen it up. Alright. Shake out. Roll it. It'll be still better rolled up, and then pop one of these sheets. Oh, that's amazing! In this little organza bag. Just fold it up like that. Pop it in there. How cute! Need to get some more of these bags in there. Getting low. Squeeze all the air out. Look, these bags are so easy to use. They're really cheap as well. Not expensive at all. So, just got it like that. Just going to put a couple of stickers on it there we go cute so I need to also send off my boohoo I've been meaning to do this for over a week four items that need to go back just got my tape dispenser and tape it up whack those in a bag and um, be on my way so I'll either catch up with you when I'm walking or I'll see you later good messages and we can go that way and then so that will be the walking and whatnot. oh heart rate Let's give it a go.
Don't go walkies. Don't go walkies. Don't go in any house. Rocky come in. Is Rocky come in? Yeah. Yeah. You walk it? Walkie? Walkie stay? Can on us? Where's your lead? Go get it. Go get lead. Where is it? Go find it. Walkie come in. Me <laughs> here. Yeah. Hi, I'm back. I've, uh, so I went to my mum's, um, so those two parcels that I had earlier, I had to take to two different places, which was a bit annoying, but my mum came with me, because one of them, I had to actually take into a shop, so I didn't want to leave Rocky outside on his own, because he just wanted to pinch him, so, yeah, my mum come with me and stayed outside with Rocky, um, been wearing my watch all day, I have done... 5,782 steps. You see that? Where's it gone? Yeah. There we go, it's focusing. There we go. So, yeah, I'll keep it on for the rest of the day. I might even keep it on when I go to sleep. And it can um, detect my sleep pattern. Um, but yeah, it's been absolutely fine on my phone. Now, like I said, I was given this, um, I was gifted this before Christmas. So I'm just going to have a look. I'm pretty sure I had a discount. Right, I found the discount code. It is Parson the One. So I'll pop it on the screen here. Um, it actually gives you 40% off, which even if you were just going to gift it to somebody these are usually 48.99 and that takes it down to 29 pound 40 which i just think is amazing for a proper nice smartwatch it just looks really nice with the gold and pink um and like i said it's it's done my heart rate my steps and what's the other one I'm not sure. I'll have to have a look through the leaflet, but I'm going to link them in the description box below. Um, I'll also pop the website on the screen as well with the discount code. So, completely up to you. Um, you know, you don't have to go and purchase them. You don't have to go and have a look. Just in case, you know, you were looking for a smartwatch or you were looking for something to count your steps. It's good to have on your wrist and it connects to your phone as well. Um, so let me just show you the, right, while Matthew's just gone upstairs off Mark because we want me to, it looks like that. I don't know if you can see that. There it is. So it's got all the different stuff on it. It's got my step surface today. Voila. Warm up with this pot, can't we? Yeah. She's just warming up with some soup up because it's got flu. Did Mine you, flu. Did you say hello to them when he said hello? You were saying hello to me. I was saying hello to them, not okay. you. <laughs> hello, Sean. Hello, Sean. Yeah, I've decided to show this watch. Well, I think it's a good watch to use. Yeah, well, I've been using it today. It's been doing my steps up. Yeah, I just wouldn't have the app on the phone. I've got the app on the phone. Have you? Yeah. Right. Just thought I'd just right. give it a go. I've just seen loads of other YouTubers using it recently, so. And were there, did you look at their reviews? They haven't actually said anything about it. It's just they're wearing it on their wrist every day. Yeah. Um, oh, look, it is, a, it is nice. It is a nice watch, yeah. And, um, do you know what, the, the app's absolutely fine. It's just like any other app that's on my phone. It hasn't got access of tracking me or anything like that, you know, and I'm not using the app. The thing is, there's bad reviews about everything, isn't there? Yeah. And that's probably all I found. I'm getting now, what with these nice bowls? Oh. Right, I've had to zoom you in because the lighting is shocking. The sky outside is beautiful. Let me see if you can see it. Never looks right on camera. Oh, it actually does look quite nice. Look at that. It's still not doing it 
as much just death as it could do. It looks gorgeous. So, so many little twigs. Matthew's going in the bath. I'm thinking of making lentil curry again tonight. That's what I'm thinking. Matthew won't eat it though. I'll have to make him something else. I'll make lentil curry again. What? I was going to make them to Kobe again. Okay. Look how nice the sky looks. Well, I'll catch up with you later. Right, I've just come back on here now to end this one. I wanted to show you my tea, but before I do, I just want to say a massive thank you to Personva for this lovely smartwatch, which I've had on all day. Let's how many, see how many steps I've done now. How many? 6,150. Not enough, but at least I've done some. And I've just said to Matthew, I am, I've been quite productive today and got dressed really early, which I don't normally do on a, on a Monday. Not very often. Um, so yeah, got dressed early, took Rocky out for his walks, took my um, parcels, went to my mum's, had lunch with my mum, came home and I've made this absolutely fantastic dinner. So I know you like my cook along, so look what, look what I've made tonight. You're not going to believe this. Let me show you. Got some smiley faces which look like we need to go on for a little bit longer. And pizza! That actually looks really nice. So, no cook along tonight. I've just uploaded my video of my meat. It's not quite a mince meat stew. Beef, beef mince stew, something like that. It was like, Matthew called it a deconstructive a deconstructed, what did you call it? Shepherd's pie? Yeah, a, deconstructed a deconstructed shepherd's pie. And it pretty much is a deconstructed shepherd's pie. But it was delicious. And I really enjoyed it. So I'm definitely going to make that one again. And it's such a cheap, easy meal to make. Matthew's probably thinking, I don't want that again. But it's because I like it. So I'm going to go and eat some pizza now. I'm in my little, well I say little snoody. It's, look at this. How long it is it goes past my knee i look absolutely ridiculous in it it's not attractive at all but it's really comfy and it's really warm and i was absolutely freezing i was sat on that sofa over there editing a minute ago freezing cold and now i'm lovely snuggly and warm and i was actually moaning last night that no not last night it's the night before i was too hot and we actually put the fan on cold blasting fan on me so that's a bit strange isn't it but yeah it's probably my age or might be my medication i don't know but anyway i'm gonna go now so if you enjoyed this one please give it a thumbs up if you're not already consider subscribing to my channel and also share my channel if you can and leave a comment for me because i love reading your comments and i am going to get round to replying to all of the Izzy's birthday comments later this evening so yeah I'll try my best to reply to everybody try my best but anyway thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one bye